I have now told you everything, truly every last detail. Oh my god! Yo, look at this right now! Oh my, yo, 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 that scared the ever living shit out of me, bruh. Yo, I was like, I was so focused on reading, like, I was, I was trying to pay attention to what, uh, everything she was saying. And then I see her face right here, you see, yo, Ekidana! Yo, she looking mad crazy! Yo, what's good, everybody? It's your boy back at it again, like always, man. Hope y'all are doing well, like always. And of course, it's a pleasure to have y'all with me here today because once again, it is Wednesday. You already know what that means, though. It is re zero day. I'm ready, bro. I'm ready, dude. Yo, yeah. The thing is, though, we're coming down to the wire, guys. You know, this is. Uh, the next episode, I mean. The next episode is the last episode for this core, and then we have to wait a little bit until we get the second part of ReZero Season 2, uh, later in the year. Probably next year, right? Or something like that, bro. But you know what? The journey so far has been... It's... <laughs> it's been phenomenal, man. Yo, by the way, I appreciate all the love and support that you guys have been showing the ReZero videos. Any, and, of course, like any other video as well. Like, you guys have just been killing it recently, and I just gotta thank you guys from the bottom of my heart for just supporting me you know loving these videos because i love doing them but anyways guys yo last episode subaru he died again and uh yeah the rabbits came through and uh they ate our ass uh, again I, I didn't think it would happen two times but it happened by the way the name of the episode today is the witch's tea party so hopefully we get to see more of ekidana typhon minerva daphne and whoever else there might be but anyways guys i'm excited i'm hyped hope y'all ready <laughs> because I don't think I am. Oh, yep. Here we go. Waking up again. Damn, I'm still. Ah, I wish they would have used that. Ah, dude, I'll, I'll, I'll always miss that. Here we go again, man. Okay, Amelia, she's gonna have her little mental breakdown thing, probably. Subaru's like, she, she kissed me. Hmm. Okay. Okay, Subaru. Okay, Subaru. I expected him to be a little bit, you know, messed up after all this, but he seems really determined. Once. If it costs me my life, bro, he said, if it costs me, cost me my life, I'ma save Amelia no matter what. Also, no opening like always, so you already know the episode's gonna slap. Oh, he's going back, huh? He's going back. He gotta go see Ekidona again. He gotta see his freaking his best girl. Oh, did it actually work? Super, are you good? Uh, he seems happy, okay. Present, huh? But whole, what, what? What? What the fuck is going on? Oh, this is when- Oh, this is when Subaru killed himself. That man gone, bro. He's already dead, yeah. We've already looped back. Okay, this is interesting. We get to see this timeline continue after he died. God damn, that is gruesome as hell. Jesus. Ah, uh, Amelia, you don't gotta hit me with that, my heart. So what exactly happened right there? Why did we see that? At first, I thought, like, was Subaru taking, like, another trial? Okay, that's actually really interesting, though, because I'm, I'm not gonna lie, like, I've always wondered how, I guess, the worlds would continue if Subaru died in that. Because, like, in my way of thinking, like, Subaru's not, like, going back in time. He's, like, just jumping from... He's basically just creating, like, other timelines, so... It just, it was very interesting to see because, like, I, I totally forgot that, you know, he he actually killed himself in, like, the first episode and, and rewinded back, so... Damn, bro. It was, uh, it was, uh, it was like, like, I'm wondering why that triggered in Subaru, though, so I'm really curious about that. The second trial. Okay, that's what I was thinking. Behold an unthinkable present. Again? Oh, shit! This is when Julius killed him! When, when, when Benogius possessed him, right? Oh, this is going crazy, dude. He really has to see all the timelines that he died and what happened after those. This arc, this arc is insane, bro. This this arc is going crazy. I'm sorry. Ah, Tomodachi, yes. <laughs> Julius, you are my friend. Damn, bro. Damn, okay, Super is starting to lose it a little bit. Okay, this one, th this trial is kind of hard. Again, oh my god. Oh my god, this is when he jumped off and killed himself. Oh, Beatrice, why do you have to keep crying? <laughs> oh my god, dude, this episode is freaking crazy. Come on, Rom, I mean, yo. Okay, so this one was the one when Puck killed him. Episode 15. This episode, by the way, Reinhardt? Reinhardt? My dude? Ooh, Puck looks kind of fucking dope, though. Hold on. Ooh. Ooh! Ooh, there's no way. Reinhardt? Against Puck? Bro, I... Yo, I'm like, god damn, Reinhardt! 
I forgot how OP this man is. Dude, he like, he like, he literally like obliterated Puck. Okay, and this is the first death. Also, fuck off. Okay, this is when Rem killed him in the mansion when he got poisoned. All right, uh, this is when he got stabbed. Oh my God, he has to see all the times he died. Jesus. Dude, I'm sorry, if I was Subaru, I would go crazy right now. I do not even want to see what this man looks like, dude. Are you good, Subaru? Okay. Yo, I'm so- Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, let me- Hold on. I knew I recognized that voice. Th is that Rem? Dude, 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 what- wh What is going on right now? Dude, I- At this point, I don't trust anything. You- You- You're probably not Rem. You're probably not the real one. Uh, yes, I am Ren. Your very own all-purpose, ever-useful mate. Nah! Nah, bro, nah! What is going on right now? Yo, this ep- Yo, I'm sorry, man. I've said this before. ReZero cannot miss with these episodes. It's like every episode. It's like a whole experience, man. It's a whole movie right now, yo. Oh my god, bro. I, I thought that the last episode was like- I thought the last episode was like god tier, but like- the fact that Subaru right now, I, I I mean, I don't know if this is the second trial because Subaru said something about that being the second trial, but like, he basically has to like, I guess, see all his deaths and like the, I guess the events that occur after that. So like, that was really cool to see. Like, I didn't even know Reinhardt showed up and obliterated Puck and it, I don't even know. And then like, it shows like how Amelia felt after Subaru died in all those timelines. And right now Rem's here. That's not Rem though. There's, there's no way. I refuse to believe that is the Rem that we all know and love, man. So, you know, it's a little bit like, I don't know. Like, I don't know why I was, I was just happy to see like Reinhardt, Julius, Felix again. And like, you know, recurring all the past events, especially the one where he, he jumped off the cliff and Beatrice was crying and Ron was, dude, I'm sorry, bro. Like, yo, <laughs> Ah, this anime is amazing. Let's just get back to it. Okay, Ram. Uh, let's just get back to it, dude. Oh god, here we go again. It's like episode 18 all over again, bro. See, like, Subaru is, like, in acknowledging that, like, yo, like, all those times, you know, that I died, like, I couldn't save you. So, like, he's just acknowledging that, like, there are other timelines that he failed in. Hmm. Maybe this is just Subaru's mind comforting himself? OST's going off, by the way. Ram? Um... Nani? Who are you? That's what I thought, bro. Who are you? You are not Rem. Yeah, Rem was always a real one, yo. Like, we can always come to her. She's still a real one. I still got respect for Rem. Like, just because Ekidana's here, don't worry. I, I still got respect for Rem. I didn't forget about the mission. Mm. Talk that talk, Subaru. Okay. So, who are you? You're a fake. Damn, you fraud. Yo, Subaru's talking all that shit right now. Oh, I thought he was gonna punch her, yo. I was about to say, like, okay, Super, I mean. Are you a witch? Which one are you? Carmilla, okay. The Witch of Lust. Interesting. It's because you wanted to see me that way. Oh, interesting, okay. So Carmilla herself, like, did it do that herself. Ekidana, what is good, bro? Ekidana was behind that. Okay, we back, though. We back. What's good, girl? So she did all this to save us so sh we wouldn't basically get mind broken doing this trial over again. Oh, so this is the second one. Okay, if you don't, okay. I swear, if you say some some I love you stuff, I swear. Don't even. Oh, okay, okay. A contract is fine. If she would have like confessed her love or something like that, I would have lost my I, I would have lost my goddamn mind. <laughs> she got that she got that sales pitch right now for that contract. I don't know, Subaru. I guess seems like a fine deal to me. I guess. I don't know though. Like this is super ominous right now. Damn, she got hella excited. Like, Yadana, what are you plotting right now? There, there, there's no way it's like, I mean, it just sounds, it sounds a little too good to be true, you know? She expected the pitch not to work. Okay. I got you. Was that, <laughs> was that Minerva? Let's go Minerva. Minerva is so extra, dude. I love her. That's what I was thinking too. I'm like, they have to, they don't, so they don't have to swap witches. Well, parts of that contract. Hold on, hold on, yo, 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 okay, okay, yo, there's a lot of info being dropped right now, so basically, Minerva's like, yo, Subaru, your boy, you, you know, you land Ekidana, you know, she's smooth talking to you right now, you're about to agree to this contract, she hasn't even told you about the bad stuff that might happen to you, man, you gotta stop falling for all this shit, and she was talking to me too, because, you know, I love Ekidana, you know, she, she's a smooth talker, she, you know, she, she smooth talks me a lot, you know, I can't, 
help but trust her. And then Minerva's coming over here like, yo, shut your bitch ass up, man. Yo, you know, you gotta think for yourself, you know, a little bit, man. You know, you can't trust everything that Ekidona is saying, saying right now. I don't know, man. The thing is, like, I, I, I was a little suspicious of Ekidana too, because, you know, she wants this contract, and she seemed... Like, she was telling us, like, yeah, if you're ever, you know, struggling or crushed under, you know, the weight of, e like, everything going on right now, you know, I will always be there to uh, support you. And, you know, I'll even have the, your, uh, I'll even, like, share in, like, your return by death thing. So, and then Super's like, okay, I mean, that seems like a fine. And she was like, oh, r r really? I'm like, oh, okay, why are you getting so ex ex excited for, you know? I'm like, uh, Akidana! Like, she expected that not to work. So, I don't know what she's plotting right now. Because a bunch of you guys are telling me, I, I don't get don't get me wrong, I read the comments. A bunch of you guys are telling me, like, yo, you like Ekidana, but you know, like, she's not all good, you know, like she she might be, you know, she she might be the best girl, but you know, she might not be all that, you know, she might be hiding a little secret or two, so I guess we'll find out, huh? Yeah, what payment this time do we gotta give? Was it my soul? A taste, yo, hold on, chill, chill on that, man. You about to make me act up. Yo, Carmilla was good. She's hiding from you, that's what I'm saying. And then, yo, Ikido's like, yo, don't bother listening, Subaru. You know, I've helped you a lot right now. Just form the contract with me, we'll be all good. I can't do that, I'm sorry. Subaru, you better not take that right now. Okay, you're a new one. Hello? Yeah, which one are you? Oh, Sloth, okay. She looks dope, hold on, she has a cool ass design. Oh my god, it was good Typhon. D d yo, don't don't get me wrong. Don't, oh my god, Daphne's here too. Okay, it was cool, but Daphne's here, man. You, you know how I feel about Daphne. Dude, they're about to jump him right now. <sighs> Super, you about to go? You, you about to do this contract? Ekidana, say something, please. Give me some hope. Give me something to trust you with. Damn, Super! Yo, he's like, enough. Yeah, I'm not even calling you by your own name. Why is she looking hella fabulous though right now? Hold on. She looking mad kawaii. This is oddly, oddly scary in a way. I don't know. Maybe it's just like the OST playing and how she just ran, ranting right now. I'm not gonna lie. This scene though looks dope as hell right now. Did your titties just get bigger? What the hell? I have now told you everything. Truly every last detail. Oh my God. Yo, look at this right now. Oh my, yo, 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 yo. Yo, that scared the ever-living shit out of me, bruh. Yo, I was like, I was so focused on reading, like, I was I was trying to pay attention to what uh, everything she was saying, and then I see her face right here, you see, yo, Ekidana! And like, dude, th th there's like the evil aura around her right now. Yo, she looking mad crazy! She's like, she's like, going in right now, like, yo, give me everything you have, you know, and then, you know, I'll be there for you too, because, I mean, I always forget that Ekidana, at the end of the day, she is the Witch of Greed, you know, she's in this for something, obviously, she wants, or she has knowledge and everything, she wants to know everything and stuff like that, so I guess... I mean, I guess she isn't all good, obviously, I mean, I assume all the witches aren't all good, but... Man, bro, the way she looking right now. Whew. I don't know, bro. I don't know how to think. All right, let's just continue. Ekidana, please, man, please. Bro, look at her. God damn. Everyone's speechless. They're like, holy shit. Mutual relationship where we use each other for our own personal gain. Ooh. Damn, Super's acknowledging that right now. Like, yo, your intentions right now are... Yikes. Oh, he calling her fake. Subaru's like, yo, everything is superficial. It's fake. It's a, it's not genuine. Oh, shit. Oh, she looked mad serious right there. She's like, next time, I'll, next time I'm with you, I'll do just that then. Hey. Give me something, Ekidana, please. How do we set Beatrice free? Okay, so Ekidana kind of tricked her, I guess. Yeah, Ekidana, how, how are we feeling about this? <sighs> it's over, bruh. It's over, man. Ah, oh, Subaru! Oh. Damn, you don't have to go that in on her. Called her a monster. Hey, Beatrice! Bako, the homie. She's here. Ooh, she looked mad as hell. Wait, Satella? How you- how- Bro, she's here! 
Don't ha- Bro, I, I I don't even know what to say. I don't know what to say. I I did not expect that, man. I did not expect that at the end. Yo, Satel is here. Uh, yo, Ikidana seems like yo. She she's like she kind of like mad. She's like damn, like she's here right now. Shit, you know. Ooh, bro. I don't know how to feel right now, guys. Damn, that was like. That episode was so... There was a lot of info. Big, big info drops. Big info drops. And, like, I'm trying to understand right now. It's just, like, I can't look at Ekidana the same anymore. Because, like, her intentions are, like, kind of... Like, like Subaru said, like, she's, like, very superficial about how she feels about stuff. Like, she's not really genuine and everything. And like Subaru was calling her a monster and a witch, like yo, like that that's not cool and stuff like that. The whole thing with Beatrice and everything, and her basically, I guess, like in a way like lying to her that that person's gonna come and Egidon herself doesn't even know who that person is. She basically said, like, yo, that it's basically up to her to choose who that person is. So I assume that person, of course, is referring to Subaru. But man, bro, Satella's coming back. To mess things up in the last episode of the core, man. Oh, that ep oh that episode, dude. Next episode, I know. Next episode is about to go nuts. They have to. They have. They have to leave us on like a high, man. They have to lead us on a big ass cliffhanger right now, huh? Okay. 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 Re Zero White Fox, I see you guys over there. I see you guys, man. I don't know, guys. I, I have a lot of conflicted feelings right now. Like I said, this episode was very, um, very dialogue heavy. Like, super dialogue heavy, obviously. Um, I really enjoyed the scenes with, um, with, like, the second trial, how, like, it was showing Subaru's, uh, deaths in other timelines and basically, like, the events that occurred after that. I, that was, I, I think that was, like, a really cool segment right there. Uh, I believe we have met all the witches right now. We have Typhon, Daphne, Minerva, Echidonna, um, I forget the witch of Gluttony's name, but she has some big titties. Satella's so here, uh, I, I, and Carmela, I don't know if I said her already, but yeah, uh, I don't know, guys, I don't know, man, this was definitely a very interesting episode, definitely a big setup episode for whatever, it, whatever, you know, we're gonna leave off in, in the next one, man. I just, I, I just know, like, I, I think the biggest takeaway is, like, I can't trust what Ekidana says anymore. Like, I can't just openly, I can't just openly simp for her anymore, you know? Like, I gotta, I gotta contain myself. I have to contain my, my love for her, even though I don't, I barely even know her, really. It's just, I don't know, I just, she was such an interesting character. I guess, like, in this episode, we got to see a little bit of her true colors, so, shit, man, I don't know, guys. I guess in the next episode, though, Satella's about to come join the freaking tea party right now. She's about to go fuck some shit up. But anyways, if you guys did enjoy, make sure to leave a like and subscribe. We're really close to 50,000 subscribers, so it would really mean the world to me if you're new and you saw this video. If you can please subscribe, man. We're really close to hitting that goal. But nonetheless, guys, fire episode like always from ReZero. Super, super excited to see how this core is going to end in the next episode. And then obviously, we got to wait a little bit until we get the second part of season two. But until then, man, the journey so far, it's been wild, and I feel like it's just going to get crazier from here. So, yeah, guys, it's been your boy Ivory. Take care of yourselves, and peace.